Now you see, I don't know what's going on at all. Again, this is a disclaimer from the last video. The audio since the Shield Arrow collab came out, and my audio is just fucked. So again, I don't know if you can hear. Nine times out of ten, you can't. Because this time around, I don't know. I literally hear nothing now. So, background music is going to carry. Either way though, what's up everybody, Aura Expert. If you didn't see, we did a community post, and the community post was asking you people, man. We were asking, you know, who y'all want to see first on the videos of the collab character. Wow, I, like, I don't hear anything. But I was asking. So we ended up with 18 votes, I think. At the end of the timer, I said it ended at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Right now it is, what, fucking 6.30, 6.37, something like that. Yeah, 6.37. So the um, thing ended 30 minutes ago, so any votes that come afterwards aren't going to really matter, but I guess it'll decide who I do next kind of thing. But the votes are in. It was a 46% um, win thing for your boy now for me. So yeah, this is the team we're going to be using today. Um, I'm not going to use Roth Talia simply because she was second on the list. So I want to have a Raftalia video by herself without actually using Naofumi. That's probably what's going to happen. So we're going to have a um, Naofumi video, no Raftalia. A Raftalia video, no Naofumi. And then Kizuna will be after Raftalia. Probably just some free to play stuff. Or after, honestly, no. It'll be Naofumi today. The Labyrinth video the day after. Then we'll do Raftalia. Then we'll do Kizuna. And then we'll probably end that week with Philo. I think that's what the schedule is going to be. So, yeah. We're just going to run this team. I really have no idea what I want to run with Naofumi. Since he's defense scaling. And, like, all this extra shit. I don't have my Tarmio build. He's only level 80. My Liz, or I could use Goddess Liz for her relive. But I really don't want to. So I just decided for Lilia, or uh, Lilia, Amelia and Lilia, that's crazy, the bars. So this is going to be the team we're running. We're going to be using combat class food for the most part. Since we are champ 5, we should easily LCC people. And 190, yeah, I should be able to LCC here. So yeah, enough blabbering, you know. We're going to go ahead and hop into these matches, play 5 matches, see what Nafumi does with all of our Talia buff. And yeah, but I guess we can walk through, right? Let me just walk through really fast since I haven't talked about what this character does, right? He has himself a nice little stance that removes all debuffs, and he's only allowed to have one applied debuff. So basically, Brunhill's Holy Relic. And then each stance gives him more defense related stats, and then at rank 2, it becomes two turns. Caps out at 80%. His the actual attack card is Curse, which prevents an enemy old gauge from filling up for two turns if they do not use a skill. That's okay but it's not nothing prevalent so that's whatever that buff is just like actually kind of mid there's a new debuff though so i mean they're, at least they're trying something and then this passive when he assumes a stance allies gain 30 percent of his defense as base stat increase and then he gets his passive mark of wrath stack and it stacks up to six times and every time you throw a aoe attack out it'll do 35 percent more damage for each wrath step so really, we're just trying to wait to get 6 stacks, and then hopefully we get a level 3 by then, and then see how much damage we're doing. So yeah, enough talking. Let's just go ahead and hop into this. Oh boy. Got a Rimuru, Liz, Trader, Melly. Okay. So I just see this, I need to pull my phone. I forgot my phone was on the dead side. 28%. So yeah, really, I don't have a meta for this team. I don't even expect this team to win every match, but this is just a cool little mono blue team I threw together, really. I haven't used Lamelia in a little bit. Definitely haven't used Lilia. So, I'm assuming we have to start with this and get some debuffs with Lilia to get her get some damage stacking for a little second. I'm like, I really don't hear anything, man. I don't understand. They need to fix this bug. I don't get it, bro. Like, it's only been happening since the collab started. So, to put more context into how this is happening, right? When I load the game up, the audio's fine. It'll work perfectly fine up until... I press the news tab, you know how it'll load up, what's new, and you press the little X bar and then the game will load in. So by the time I get to that point, the audio just stops. Which I don't, oh my god, that's a lot of damage. Makes sense though. But like, yeah, by that time, the audio is literally just done, and I can't do anything to stop it, so I don't know. Like I heard the last video, and the audio was working. 
so I really don't get it. He disabled my recovery. That's not good. So he didn't use any Liz cards, so I can probably freeze his Liz. That'll be a pretty good option. So let's do another stance. Because I feel like he's dead next turn. We stance up, we do this, and then we freeze the Liz. Let's just see how much damage we're doing with rank two. The stance is kind of useless, really, but that's not bad. 168 with a rank two is not bad at all. I could have potentially killed it if I really attacked again. At least the Liz. I think he has red Tarmiel on his melee, which isn't the best thing ever, but you know, it's whatever. But yeah, he got a decent hand here. And if he attacks and not kill my Nalfami again, I think Nalfami wipes, actually. Unless he has three single targets, we might be in a pickle. Two, actually, is enough. Interesting. That's not good. Mmm. Didn't kill, okay. Well, Nalfami's dead this turn, unfortunately. Can't do really do enough about that one. I guess Red Tarmiel will probably be better for Nalfami. But, I don't know. Not really sure if I want to use Red Tario or not. So let's do the. Get some buffs. Actually, let's do it this way. Get some buffs. Get some more buff Or debuffs, I mean. Get some more debuffs. And then the level 3, if it doesn't kill Liz, I guess I'll kill with the Lilia, unfortunately. That's a little unfortunate. Alright. Alright. <sighs> 100k though. That probably wouldn't have killed Rimuru or um, Melly, so there's that. My Melly is also old. A fucking yeah, he has Tommy only on Melly or Rimuru. I think it is Melly. That's a little annoying, but whatever. I don't really need him, and as long as he doesn't kill my Lilia, we're fine. So hopefully he goes for the Amelia. In all honesty. Okay, that's cool. I might still ult even though I'm nullified. It just makes sense to me. Not like the most sense ever, but I just kind of want to. Uh, all right, let's just remove. Mm. If I attack, right, that gives me more debuffs, even though she nullified. So that gives me some Sario buffs. We ult with Lilia, and then um, uh, I don't think she survives another turn. So I'm gonna just get rid. I'm gonna just ult with Lilia. She's not surviving another turn. It's just not happening. The ult's not gonna kill on Lily or Amelia's side, so Lilia's gonna be doing a lot of damage, hopefully. Okay. Lilia kinda fell flat there. She's definitely not doing anything. Yeah, kinda didn't expect her to. So we definitely lost this one. So let's just go ahead and head out. Yeah, this one's not worth our time anymore. We, we lost. Okay. Another DN Melly Liz. This time we'll do it properly, right? I mean, when I see properly, I still have Blue Tarmi Ho, so... I got a rank 2 buff, I mean, that's cool. So let's do this. I don't want you to stance turn 1. So we're just gonna throw these out there. And he forfeit. Why? Why would you forfeit against me, bro? What, what in my team was actually threatening to the point that I got a rank 2 taunt and you just wanted to quit. That meant some one of y'all talking off from you motherfuckers must have traumatized this boy. Alright, next match. Got a Lost Vein. Oh, the OG Glue Eater with no CC. I mean, technically, I could still lose to this if I threw the game correctly. And he has an Ult Rush variant too. Okay, so I get. Uh, I, can't, I can't really kill anyone this turn, right? So it's, uh, I mean, he has a level 80 Liz. It's possible I can just kill her. Mm, let's do the Lilia AoE here. I need him to attack. I don't think he... He technically doesn't even need to attack. All he needs... Oh, he has four Lost Vein cards? Oh, that's just fucking great. Alright, well, we... That's the best RNG you can possibly have with this team. This nigga got four Lost Vein cards. He doesn't have to use any of them. He can just use something else. Get Lost Vein's ult and he can potentially, potentially win. Is that a stance? Cool. Okay. Uh, I can just freeze two people here. That's fun. That's cool. Yeah, the Lost Vein ain't doing no damage to you. Um, 
Let's do... I don't think I need the stance, but I guess I should, right? Hmm. No, let's not stance. Let's AoE, break the shield. Um, let's go for the melee with the attack, and then freeze the Escanor. I think this breaks shield, correct? It doesn't. Okay, well that's perfectly fine, I guess. The freeze doesn't really matter that much. In terms of damage, right? So we can freeze these two. He only has one attack. I still haven't got any Nalphamy cards, unfortunately. So I need to kill Lost Vein here, or I'm just gonna be a rough time. I think, okay. Can I kill him twice? I mean, it's possible. Mm, is it though? I don't have a lot of damaging cards, right? Uh, okay. We're gonna have to just throw Lilia at him real quick. Into the now for me, then hopefully Lilia kills again. Because now for me, definitely kills here. He's type advantage and everything. And he's low enough that my Lilia should kill. Cool. Okay. And Lilia take him out. Beautiful. Beautiful. Alright. She moving in the right direction. I like that. Now I don't gotta worry about a level 80 Liz. Who's in the back, Merlin? Oh, this man had an ult rush team and he wasn't using it properly. Alright. Is this a real player? Like, there's no way this isn't, though, right? Because this man's really out here using Glue Eater 2-2... Two, two, or 2020, bro. Like, chillax, my guy. The team died literally two years ago. Goddess Liz was gone for, like, a millennia. I'm fine with this. He wasted stun on her. That means I've got a free buff. Uh, can't really do anything about the heal. I have two attack cards. There's nothing I can do here. So let's just try to do damage, I guess. Get her ult while taunting with mouth for me. There's really nothing I can do in this situation. I'm gonna broke the shield, so I get a little bit of buff. Do I kill? I killed! Cool. I'll take it. I mean, if she is level 80, I definitely didn't take that into occurrence. Can I get an attack with now for me, please? No? Okay. Now, I'm just getting all the stance with this man, but he hasn't getting, gotten any attacks. So, he's just not really being that great of a unit, you know? And I know I said earlier, right? I just realized what I said that um, Samson isn't gonna help me. Yes, it will because his passive gives me thirty, give allies thirty percent of stats. So again, we can do that. Stance, ult with Amelia. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stance, ult with Amelia, ult with Lilia, and that that just kills. I think the Lilia kills without the Merlin, or the Amelia kills without the Lilia. Hopefully, I want her windscreen. Yay! 6-6 six, six, Amelia, baby! Love to see it. <laughs> I can't fucking hear it though, bro! It's so annoying! This bug is so annoying! I hate it with a passion. That's why I'm talking so much. Because without game audio to like carry like the voice lines from the characters attacking, it's just so much dead air when I'm not talking, bro. Especially since I don't have any game volume. Oh, I hate it here. I really do. I hope this video has uh, like actual audio when I look back at the recording. Because sometimes you can do that. Like, my game doesn't technically need audio for the audio to be picked up in the record. Yeah, excuse me. It doesn't need audio for me for it to be picked up in the recording. Because I'd be recording some of the videos on just straight up mute. And sometimes the audio gets picked up. So hopefully it's one of those times. I'll CC by an Esterosa, not the best um, um, t thing ever. Hopefully he throws some AoEs in there. I could get away with something. If he attacks, nah. If he, even if he encroaches, that's enough to cuck an alpha me, especially since he's going on defense. He's going for the AoE shot though. Mm. I can try to pull something off here, but it won't be good. Right, so mm, mm, let's go for the Esterosa here. We're gonna buff, do the now for me, and then either way it goes, I'm pretty much fucked. But I mean, I might as well try to take out Esterosa at the very least. I know freezing would have been better in this situation, but I'm dead regardless. The encroachment, even if I manage to survive, I'm just gonna get cooked. Okay. Now, if we didn't do as much damage as I wanted him to do, which is perfectly fine, it makes sense, really. 
But now I gotta worry about this. More AoEs and stuff, I'm assuming. This man's getting AoE central. Did, did he pull another one? Oh, yeah, my entire team is fucking infected. He had a level 2? Oh, that's just pure fucking RNG. Alright, well, we're dead. Yeah. And crushing, he still didn't crit me. I'm impressed by now for me, actually, with that feat. But yeah, um, yeah, nothing I can do here. That's just, no, I'm not even gonna. He went first, so. Any, uh, any demon team that goes first is just an instant win. Especially since I'm not using a crazy team. Alright, um, I guess we're getting into the last match. It was quicker than I thought it would be, but it's okay. Because I just got off work and I got things to do, so this video can be quicker than my new usuals. I mean, I haven't shown a lot of Nalfami gameplay, though. I want to get, a, like, a level 3 off or something. But I'm not getting the RNG for it, you know? So this is just getting mad annoying in that sense. Like, this definitely isn't the best showcase for Nalfami ever, and nor is this team, right? Because I'm not using Raftalia, his best companion. So, I mean, they're really just fucking around with him at this rate. Ah... Alright, definitely freezing Chandler because I don't want to deal with the taunt. So, let's do this. And then freeze. I don't think Melly is going to be the hugest problem ever with one buff. Did he get a. Okay, he got a Chandler start too. So, I need to make sure I lock Chandler down before he nullifies me. If he nullifies me at any point, then Alpha Me's kind of cut. I do have a rank 2 finally. But I want a rank 3. I don't know how I'm going to get that while holding him down. If I don't get a freeze literally every turn, it's not gonna happen. On top of that, the demon team is just too quick. So if I don't kill them in or they Esterosa in two turns, I'm literally fucked. So I gotta think. I can kill um, I don't know if I can kill him this turn. Uh I can't. There's no fucking way. Especially when three stacks mm. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I can't do anything without, like, cucking myself. He's dead next turn. So, I mean, I guess I gotta try to go for level 2 here. Let's, um, fucking freeze just because we can. Attack him. And then level 2 AoE. We have nothing better to do. I know we don't have the stance, so it's not gonna hit hard. But, yeah, we're not killing, bro. It's not happening without rough talk, yeah. Yeah, the damage is mediocre as fuck. Okay. Ah, uh, that's fucking annoying. Okay, well, now for me, he's 100% dead. Ah, oh, fuck. <clears throat> I don't know, I guess it was just a team come problem. No one's really helping now for me, except for Guild Thunder. Is he not going for now for me, question mark? Or is he just encroaching him? He's going for my Amelia? Why? I mean... I guess, but like, that was weird. Uh, well, I mean, Nalfami still isn't gonna do damage, even with all of this stuff going for him, so I mean, it's really nothing I can do here, even with the sad circumstance. Yep. Yep, yeah, that makes sense. Nothing at all happening. Well, there's, I mean, wait. Our encroach was cleansed. When did the fuck, when did that happen? Am I missing something here? I need to go back and, what? Wait, wait, bro. When did my encroach get cleansed? Or the darkness? I, is it because now for me, passive only allows one debuff? Wait, I'm so confused. What happened to the the darkness stack? Does the darkness stack not work? No, it does. I'm so lost. He nullified him too. Uh, can I? Is it, well, this is just a waste of my fucking time. Nullifying characters are so fucking annoying. I mean, what does this even do? Can mm, nothing. Nothing damage-wise is gonna help me in this situation. Like, literally nothing at all. Especially since he has a fucking Q-Sack. 
So like, yeah, there's nothing I can do. <clears throat> I hurt. That also hurt. This man's critting now. That's always fun. I don't know what to do. This is just gonna be a. I'm just waiting to die at this point. There's nothing I can do in this situation, especially if he has another Chandler and uh, nullify. He can't. He can't encroach me. If he has, he attacks three times. He can't encroach me. So we'll have to sacrifice a taunt at the very least. Good damage, like unironically. And I'm also encroaching my Lily. He has another one, okay. Well, that wiped, oh, of course it did. Okay, this is, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking with this one. Okay, buddy, well, you really need Ralph Tali on your team, don't you? That's a unfortunate L. I mean, I wouldn't say he needs Rough Talia. I just need a better composition of a team. That team had really no synergy. But I was just trying something different. Because I've already known... Everyone found all the meta teams for this dude already. So I'm just trying stuff I haven't seen before, really. So, without... Blah, 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 I can't speak. With that being done, with that being said, I still like Nelfa me. That wasn't the best showcase of the character. Because I just really got no cards of his in the inner long scheme of things. I would still say he's good though, so like again. Uh, he kinda needs Rough Talia, I'm not gonna lie. So I guess we'll have to see him when we see it. But for now, I guess we're gonna end the video here. Since I got things to do, people to see, and people to cry about. So yeah, I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.